It has been 150 years since the start of the Civil War. It's an era in which our state has a rich history. So this morning there are going to be a lot of big events happening all around our capital city to commemorate the start of the war. Fox Connecticut's Audrey Kuchin is live in Hartford with more on what's happening this morning. Audrey? Good morning, guys. Good morning, everybody. Yeah, Connecticut has such a rich history when it comes to the Civil War. So many stories to be told. So that's exactly what they're doing here at the state capitol today. The cannons are lined up. The infantry reenactors are getting in their places. The state's commemorating the 150th anniversary of the battle that really marked the beginning of the Civil War, and it happened on this day, April 12, 1861. Today, a cannon firing here at the state capitol. It marks that anniversary of the Confederate firing on Fort Sumter, which which inaugurated four years of bloody civil war, a trying moment for the nation, the union and the state of Connecticut. Fort Sumter, South Carolina, also holding a similar commemorative firing this morning. Connecticut's cannon firing is the only northern response. So 10 cannons, infantry reenactors and volunteers from Connecticut's 11th, 14th and 2nd regiments, along with the governor, all going to be on hand here this morning at around 8 a.m. Malloy will give that order. Gentlemen, man your guns and the firing will go on for about 10 minutes. So everybody in the state invited to come on down here and commemorate uh, this momentous occasion. If you can't make it, though, don't worry about it. Fox Connecticut has you covered. We're going to be here live at 8 a.m. So uh, we'll take you to it. Also coming up at 7 a.m. in our uh, next hour, I got the opportunity to sit down with a CCSU professor, sort of the uh, expert on this time period in the state of Connecticut. And he gives us some unique perspective on Connecticut's role in the Civil War and also draws some interesting parallels between what was happening 150 years ago and really what's going on uh, in our nation's capital today. So that'll be coming up at around 7 o'clock. But for now, I'll send it back to you, Sarah and Logan. Audrey, thanks. thanks. Check in with you a little while. It is 6.37.